The Bentram TC88 kiln controller is made in Germany. This particular one has the facility for programming 16 different firing schedules. There is a switch at the bottom here, which when turned on shows a set of numbers for self-checking and then displays the um, current temperature of the kiln. Up here is uh, numbers which show the step numbers. Uh, this uh, button here is the uh, program button and by pressing it you can cycle through the number of programs available which are in this case uh, 16. For this demonstration I'm going to show you the settings that I've previously set up for a bisque firing consi consisting of eight steps. At the center of the controller are uh, four buttons, left arrow, right arrow, plus and minus. Think of each program as a staircase. Pressing the left arrow takes you to the first step at the bottom of the staircase and pressing the right arrow progresses you up the stairs to the top and we're going to create eight, an eight-step staircase in this case. Or Each step has two elements, the first being time and the second temperature. And so e at each step we set the time and then we set the temperature. Um, Okay, I've set my bisque firing schedule up on program two, so we'll select it. Oh, I've gone past it. We'll go back through, and that's at program two. We press the left arrow to take us right at the bottom of the staircase, and double zero is showing here. Now at the beginning of each program it allows you to set a time delay. You can use this for um, taking advantage of any uh, low power tariffs that your supply, a power supply company might offer um, nighttime tariffs at a cheaper rate. You set the number of hours that you want the kiln to start up after you have pressed the start button. In this case, we'll leave it at zero. Our first step is to set the time. And in this case, it is one hour. We can alter those settings with the plus <coughs> or the minus button. We're on stage one still, and we set the temperature. In this case, it is 90 degrees Celsius. So basically, we're asking the kiln to start up and take one hour to reach a temperature of 90 degrees. Pressing the right button, we go to stage two to the first element of time. And I've set this for two hours. And pressing the right button, the temperature at 90 degrees, which is what we'd set it previously. So in, in reality, what we're asking the kiln to do is start up over the period of one hour, reach the temperature of 90 degrees. Once it's reached that, to stay at that same temperature for the next two hours. I hope you're starting to get a feeling for what the principles are. Pressing right arrow to step three. The time setting is set for one hour. And pressing the right arrow again, the temperature is set at 150. So we want to now get, uh, get the kiln to go from 90 degrees 
to 150 degrees Celsius over the period of one hour. Hope you're getting the idea. Step four, the time is set for 30 minutes and the temperature is still at 150 so we want it to stay at 150 degrees for the next 30 minutes. Right arrow again. Time setting is five hours now. And the temperature setting is 550. So step five, we go from 150 to 550 over five hours. Right arrow, 30 minutes again and still the temperature at 550 so we wanted to hold it at 550 for a further 30 minutes right arrow set time setting is now four hours temperature setting is 1000 so over the next four hours we go from 550 to 1000 degrees celsius and that's at step seven. Step eight, that's the finish, because once it's reached 1,000 degrees Celsius, then we want to uh, finish our program and let the uh, kiln cool down on its own. To um, select the end button, you use the minus button, um, which is the lowest one um, uh, 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 lowest setting on the minus okay so we have the eight steps of our program now we want to store it into memory and we do that by pressing this button here I've pressed it and that has stored the program to memory and it's actually turned the kiln on I don't want to run the program at this point so I just Press that button again, red light comes up, the kiln is turned off. Well, I hope you've got some idea now how to program your Ventrup uh, TC88 um, kiln controller. Happy kiln um, firing. Thank you for watching this video.